Lewis, now listen to me, okay? Stage fright is nothing to be ashamed of. I've seen stars in all sorts of states. I've even had Anthony Kiedis from the Red Hot Chili Peppers on my shoulder in tears. And that was another story though. Oh, it's just you two. I thought you two didn't come out during daytime. It's Lewis. We need your help. He's been kidnapped by this Morgan guy and replaced with an alien clone. Look, I don't need this today, guys. No, we're serious. Look, you may not be an item anymore, but you must still care about him. He says things like two-lane blacktop instead of road now and chow for now. What, he actually said that? Yeah. And we don't think he's happy. Well, what do you want me to do about it? You're the one with the brains. We need to speak to him before he disappears completely up his own rectum. Well, isn't he on tour or something? They're filming his Top of the Pops debut this afternoon. Look, this afternoon, I, I can't this Joe, afternoon. Joe, you got him into this. I mean, you've got to walk in like you own the joint, not like you've just broken in or something. What are we going to do tonight? We're going to rock and roll. We're going to kill him out there, yeah? Keep selling, baby. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. I'm a rock star. I am a rock star. No, Lewis, you're a knobhead with vegetables on his face. What are you doing here? Where's Morgan? What's with the dolphin song? Oh, it's just Wales, actually. Morgan reckons it helped me discover my inner performance. You know what I mean? What a twat. How's the shop? Oh, it's good, it's good, yeah. Uh, we completed Space Invaders and uh, Mono sold a box set last week. Mono, man, way to go. <laughs> 10 points, Mazira Syllabic Amiga. So you enjoying this rock star malarkey then? Yeah, 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 it's good. It starts are so early, it's hardly worth going to bed, you know, but it's all bona fide. Locked and loaded for my TOTP debut. See, right there? Yeah. I mean, what's that? What would the old Lewis have thought somebody spoke like that? I knew it. I know, you always do this. I try to give you guys the benefit of the doubt, but you just come down here and scup on the big night. We've come down here to help you. Listen to yourself, eh? This is him speaking. You're just jealous and you're bitter. Because I'm the one with talent and you're the ones who just push pints and uh, pull, uh, whatever. Just listen to yourself, Lewis. You're a complete joke. Save your breath, mate. We've lost this one to the dark side already. Absolutely. Good luck, yeah? Don't cock it up in front of millions, will you? Come, Ed. We need Charlie here. We've got to vote her out. I don't think she'd be happy about that. When the audience, that's you. Look, they look right. We need her back here. We need to get as many votes as we can. I mean, historically, fame was only afforded to those who deserved it. Today, Jodie Marsh. I mean, it's debased. And this whole sordid display here, it's just demeaning. Yeah, I can't imagine anything worse than being famous. I mean, being hounded by the paparazzi night and day, being mobbed in Agnes B. I mean, I just find that totally... I find it totally... horrible. Yeah, I didn't come on here to be famous. <laughs> so, you've seen our wannabes, now it's all down to you. Let's get those thumbs working. Come on, you guys too. I know she wants to stay in the house and win, but we really need her help out here, don't we?